Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you are new. This is like my 100th time doing this voiceover because I can't talk right. I'm running on like zero hours of sleep because I decided to shoot this video at one o'clock because this was actually not my original idea. I shot a whole video with my friends, I started editing it, and it wasn't long before I realized we didn't have enough footage because we shot everything in time lapse, and I didn't realize that time lapse went that fast. And on top of that, the art I produced in that video was not good. So maybe I'll, I'll like post that video as like an extra video or something. But for now, this is what I have out. This drawing was inspired by the song Please Mr. Postman by the Marvelettes. It's a part of a two-piece series that I did. I will insert a picture of the other drawing in the series. Um, during this drawing, two markers died. Two of my favorite markers, E71 and R35. And I kind of cut a lot of the footage from me coloring the skin, or specifically the legs, because that's when the markers die. And the flowers, because R35 is what I used for the um, highlight on the flowers. And that died, and it was really unsatisfying, because I'm like scratching out the paper to get ink out. And oh, that's just one of my pet peeves. When markers die, it makes me, the sound it makes when, I don't even know what to say anymore. Um, I would like to say a big thank you to everyone from TikTok. If you don't know, I have, I reached 130k like a day or something ago. I don't even know. My TikTok just blew up. And yeah, so I'd like to say thank you. I also have like a thousand something on here and my Instagram also has like a thousand something. So a lot has happened recently and I'm kind of freaking out because I have a lot of pressure on my shoulders and some like company messaged me or something I don't even know I'm trying to figure things out I don't even know what to talk about anymore because I have a list of things I have to talk about and I already talked about everything so I'm just gonna go on the fly now I guess because I'm not redoing this voiceover and I also have to go somewhere at one o'clock so that doesn't really leave me much time anyways so uh I did some fancy shading or not really fancy shading but there's two lighting sources there's one there's a little backlighting on her and then the there's like the main source of lighting is coming from her left. So yeah, that was fun. And I incorporated pink and purple into the shadows of her dress because when I color things that are white, I don't like shading with gray because I think gray is boring. So I like using pinks and purples to shade. And for this drawing, I tried to do a more full body type because in the other piece in this series, the... um the person I drew was skinnier and more slender, so I wanted to try something different. And I know I don't draw a lot of fuller people, and I know I should, but yeah, I'm gonna be working on that. I actually did a mermaid. It was Mermaid Day 13. If you don't know what mermaid is, mermaid is a challenge that artists do where they draw a mermaid every day of May. Um, On May 13th, I did a more fuller mermaid, so. I posted that on my TikTok, so if you want to go check that out, it's there. I don't really know what the thing swirling around her is, TBH, but yeah, I tried to play with expression in the two pieces in the series, and this one she's supposed to be looking more like stern or upset or something, because she got the, um, there's like a story behind this. In the first drawing, she's waiting for the letter and she's sad because she hasn't gotten the letter yet. And in this drawing, she got the letter, even though it's like floating around her. We'll pretend that she like opened it and she saw the letter and she didn't like what was inside the letter. So yeah, I was listening to the whole entire Please Mr. Postman album and it like takes you through like a whole entire story. So yeah, that's what this is inspired by. I tried to um incorporate reds to the green on like the flowers and stuff because um to tone it down so yeah is that gonna be in the video mm -hmm. so you're not videoing it no i am oh oh you should i'm on the fucking recording no you're not i cut cool. all the audio Damn it, you should keep this part in, it's kind of funny. Yeah, I feel like I have a lot of responsibility on my shoulders and I don't really know what to do anymore. And I was getting a lot of hate comments and stuff like that. And <laughs> Oh my God, it kind of sucks, I don't know. I'm just trying to work it out. And I know like, some people are acting really out of pocket and I feel like on the internet people say whatever they want but in real life, they wouldn't say those things to your face. So it's whatever. 
I don't even know what to say anymore, guys. I'm so sorry. I'm so bad at this. I had to cut so much footage from the flowers and the um, skin because the markers died. And I have no money. And I need to buy a scanner because I want to start selling prints. And I want to open an Etsy. And I want to make a website using Wix. And I want to start taking commissions again. And I already have three commissions I have to do. And I have to go to like some graduation party at one o'clock and I w wants to like finish the commission today so I'm kind of a hot mess and I'm really tired so yeah um I really went harder with the colorless blender because I wanted the um yellow and the orange for like the little swirly thing going around her to be more dulled out so I was literally scrubbing for my life for like that whole entire process. So I kind of cut a lot of that out too. Cause like the colorless blender is basically just alcohol. And so it looks like I'm doing nothing even though I am. So I kind of just cut most of the footage with the colorless blender cause I wanted it to be actually interesting for you guys. And there's also a lot of things I did off camera that I didn't include in here. And also um, I had to cut a bunch of the parts where my head was sticking in the camera because I can't keep my big head out of the camera. So that's fun. So now I'm just gonna add some white jelly roll details and then I'm gonna like show you some ending pictures of the final drawing where you can see all the details I added after because in this, I added like some leaves swirling around her and I added the postcard which you can't see in this. And yeah. Oh yeah, and I also added some like sparkles around her. So I didn't record that. <laughs> I'm so sorry, guys. I'm so out of it. This is so bad. <laughs> okay, guys. I think this voiceover is almost over. <laughs> so, yeah. And I don't know if I mentioned this earlier, but the flowers in the corners, those are called hibiscus. Is hibiscus? Yeah. So, anyways, bye, guys. Thank you for watching this video so much. I'm just going to let this video run for the rest of, rest of it without any voiceover because all it is is, like, me doing some jelly roll pen work. So bye guys, thanks for watching. My Instagram and TikTok are in the description of this video. So go check those out to see content that I do not post on here. So yeet. And also on TikTok, I have a Copic marker giveaway and I have an art contest going on. So you guys who are artists out there should go enter those. And they both end July 31st. Yeah, they both end July 31st. So make sure you go enter those. Bye. Oh, and I also forgot to mention, well, not by yet. I, um, I'm going to debate camp for two weeks, so I might miss like two uploads. So yeah, but I will be uploading next week and then I'm going to debate camp for two weeks. And then I have a week in between where I'll upload again. And then I'm going to Hawaii. Bye guys. Thanks for watching. Love you guys the most.